Dear friends, greetings and peace. Back in 1994, the late Pope John Paul II has established our Maronite Eparchy of Our Lady of Lebanon of Los Angeles. For the last 24 plus years, we have grown. We have reached out to many. We have done so many good things. Imagine just for a moment, how many people came to churches be fed from the body and blood of Christ. How many people were married at our churches? How many people were baptized? And how many people, unfortunately, we said goodbye to them and they're enjoying everlasting life. So many good people, clergy, religious, and laity, have dedicated their life to honor God and to serve their brothers and sisters. And they were good stewards in our eparchy as well. My gratitude to all of them and the assurance of my prayers. As we are getting ready to celebrate our Silver Jubilee next year, our eparchy is getting ready as well to launch its capital campaign, the first of its kind, with its theme, vision for the future and mission for today. Vision for the future is to make sure we keep opening more churches, more missions to serve our people wherever they are, to form the people who are in charge of it, seminarians, priests, and lay ministers as well, religious, so that we will have great people at the service of our great churches as well. Will be a lot of ministries to enhance our ministries of youth, children, families, catechism and every way so that we could serve our people a lot better. Serve whatever we have and welcome new ones and bring back those we've lost for one reason or another. My brothers and sisters, during that year they will have many opportunities and many events, but most importantly, we need to come together in prayer. I call upon you, my brothers and sisters, my brother priest, deacon, subdeacon, religious monks and nuns, and all of you, young and young at heart, married, celibate, whatever your position in life is, let's come together. Thank God for so many years of grace. Reflect and see how can I serve better? How I can I become missionary disciple to build up the kingdom of God. I say this not only to you, but to me first, that I would need to recommit myself to serve you better. But I assure you of my love and my prayers. I'm here with you every step of the way. My brothers and sisters, God bless you. Thank you for who you are and what you do. And all together, we give you glory and honor to God in our word, in our deeds, and to serve our brothers and sisters. God bless.